When you're young, you know it hurts to fall. That's why at some point we all learn how to hold on. But somewhere along the way, some of us forgot how important it is to hold on. That's a mistake none of us can afford to make, because at our job, slip, trip, and fall hazards are everywhere. We need to acknowledge that an average of 400 longshore workers a year in the U.S. alone won't make it to work the next day as a result of a slip, trip, or fall injury. Of those of us who get injured, many will miss significant work. And for some of us, our families will never be the same. This isn't a wake-up call. This is a life-changing call. There are people in our lives that love us and that we love. They rely on us, people who need us to hold on. Like any time you enter or exit a job site, hold on. Take a minute to assess the situation for hazards. Ask yourself, do you have on the appropriate footwear for the job that day and the conditions at hand? When you come across obstructions on a ship deck, in a yard, or on a dock, can you safely navigate or work in an area where there are housekeeping issues? Or can you take steps to clear the situation before beginning your work or for the next guy? When you get into or out of any power industrial truck, like forklifts, strads, RTGs, top picks, and yard tractors, anytime you go up and down stairs on a ship, on equipment, or when using ladders for maintenance, Take a minute first to hold on. These are particularly hazardous areas for longshore workers. Many before you have suffered time off from work because of a greasy stair, step, or ladder run. When you're working on or moving around uneven or wet surfaces like loading ramps and catwalks and lashing bays. Anytime you move backwards or turn around while working, even on the dock, potholes and crane trenches can trip you up and put you down. Or worse, trip you into the path of a bigger, more deadly hazard. Don't think it hasn't happened. Take a breath, hold on for a second, and get your head in the game. Little slips, trips, and falls cause real injuries and real fatalities to dock workers. We all need to do better and stop slip, trip, and fall incidents from happening. And this is how we do it. Remembering the first safety lesson we all learned. When you take that extra step to hold on and work safely, you hold on to the things that matter. The people who hold on to you.